The anticipation for the upcoming Galaxy S25 Ultra is building rapidly, especially with new leaks and renders providing tantalizing glimpses of what's to come. From the design to the hardware, Samsung appears to be pulling out all the stops to make this the most comfortable and powerful device in its lineup. While the Galaxy S24 Ultra was already a premium device, the S25 Ultra is set to be even more refined. Early renders have revealed that the S25 Ultra will feature slightly rounder edges, a subtle but significant change from its predecessor. This design tweak is expected to make the device more comfortable to hold, compared to the Galaxy S24 Ultra, which digs into the hands during extensive use. Beyond just the feel in hand, Samsung is making strides to ensure that the Galaxy S25 Ultra stands out as the thinnest and lightest flagship phone on the market. According to recent leaks, the Galaxy S25 Ultra will surpass its major competitors, including the iPhone 16 Pro Max and the Pixel 9 Pro XL, in terms of both thickness and weight. The Pixel 9 Pro XL, for instance, measures 8.5 millimeters in thickness and weighs 221 grams. The iPhone 16 Pro Max, which is expected to be released on September 9, is rumored to have a thickness of 8.25 millimeters and a weight of 225 grams. In comparison, the Galaxy S25 Ultra will reportedly have a thickness of less than 8.25 millimeters and weigh under 221 grams, making it noticeably more slender and lighter than these rivals. Moreover, when compared to its predecessor, the Galaxy S24 Ultra, which had a thickness of 8.6 millimeters and weighed 232 grams, the S25 Ultra will be at least 0.35 millimeters thinner and 7 grams lighter. These improvements may seem small on paper, but in practice, they contribute to a device that is not only easier to handle but also more portable. Samsung has also packed the Galaxy S25 Ultra with a formidable camera setup. Leaks indicate that the device will feature a quad camera system at the rear, led by a 200 megapixel primary sensor, complemented by three additional 50 megapixel cameras, one with a telephoto lens, another with a super telephoto lens, and a third with an ultra wide lens. This versatile camera array suggests that the Galaxy S25 Ultra will cater to photography enthusiasts, offering a range of options to capture everything from expansive landscapes to detailed close-ups. For selfies, the device will continue to offer a 12-megapixel front camera as its predecessors. Under the hood, the Galaxy S25 Ultra will be powered exclusively by Qualcomm's Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 chipset, promising top-tier performance and efficiency, while the standard Galaxy S25 and the S25 Plus might be available with the company's in-house Exynos 2500 chip in some regions. Both processors are similarly powerful, so you should expect top-tier performance irrespective of which chip is offered in your region. With that said, the Galaxy S25 Ultra is undoubtedly one of the most anticipated upcoming flagship offerings. As leaks continue to emerge, it's clear that Samsung is committed to refining the flagship experience, making the S25 Ultra a device that not only competes with, but potentially surpasses the best in the market. And as we move closer to its official launch, the leaks and speculation surrounding this device is only expected to grow, so make sure you're subscribed to the channel to always stay updated. Also, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and turn on post notification, and I'll see you guys on the next one.